Hey guys, it's TechWiper, and I'm here to bring you the discussion Gaming Mania and I had right before the Direct last uh, Thursday. So, yeah, we had a good 30 minutes to wait before the Direct actually started, so we discussed some stuff and even mess around. Just keep in mind that this video isn't really meant to be watched, more to be listened to. So you can just relax in the chair or the bed you're lying on and then just listen to this conversation. Enjoy. So we wanted to do a uh, kind of our own reactions to direct since they're see since se it seems a lot. Ugh. I don't know what I'm saying. Sorry. This is not scripted. <laughs> so anyway. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Tune in for the new Okay, upcoming 3DS and Nintendo Switch titles. So it's still, so it's basically gonna be talking about what is it? It's probably gonna be talking about see, some of the games that Nintendo has lined up, like mm, I don't know, uh, maybe a new DLC from Mario Kart 8. Oh, that'd be nice. We already got some new DLC from well, well, technically it was more of an update. We got like Breath of the Wild Link. Yeah. That was interesting, I, I like that. I find it kind of weird that they add DLC to Mario Kart 8 Deluxe at around Wait. the time they did add DLC. Yeah, it's a little odd. I'm not gonna lie. Very odd, but hey. Nintendo's odd. Nintendo's odd anyway, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, the chat is going nuts. Yep, it sure is, but I'm not able to see it. I put my video on full screen. Yeah, man, this is like... I just saw someone talking about Gino! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everybody's thinking Gino's gonna be in Smash Ultimate. And that seems to be the popular theory right now. If they if they show off Gino and then they show off Shadow the Hedgehog, I'm gonna laugh. I'm gonna laugh. That, that'll be fun. That'll I be... have a feeling they'll show off two new characters in a Smash Bros. Direct, not in a Nintendo Direct. It's like, we'll probably save the new Smash Bros. character for the end of the Direct, like they did for Cloud and King K. Rule. Oh yeah. You never know. We'll find out. You know, yeah. I mean, just depending with this, they might actually be announced, like, might, they might be having, like, one a month. And they, yeah. like, and they'll just show off the new character. Like that, or like they show off like the, the new character in the beginning, like like they did with Simon. Hmm. That would be interesting, now would it? Yeah, I guess it would. Hold oh. on, I'm gonna go get some water. All right. I'll be right back. I will distract the audience. Whoa. All right. Uh, one of the okay. One of the questions I'm gonna ask you guys is, what are you most excited about for this next Nintendo Direct thing? Are you excited about the games? Are you excited about new Smash characters? Because as you already know, me and my buddy here, we're pretty excited for, for characters. So hopefully, once this starts, round five, I believe that's what they said. It says a. It says it's gonna start at six, but I got I looked at the video and it said it was gonna start at like five. Alright. Sorry for the interruption, but at that point I wasn't able to hear Gaming Mania. So yeah, I thought he was busy with something. Anyways. Got my two bottles of water. Alright, I already got a bottle of water, so I'm I'm good. I'm good. Anyway. Hopefully we did not start at the wrong time, and if we're gonna have like a hat yeah, to have a... to crunch up my water bottles for this video in case the in case something important gets announced, and you hear the sound of my water bottle crunching <laughs> over the recording, <laughs> and won't that be obnoxious? Yeah. Well. So besides, like, Gino... Well, nothing important is happening right now, so, uh... <laughs> of course. 
Anyway, as I was asking, as I was asking, what are you most excited for? Like, what other characters are you excited for? What games are you? What? Andrew, you there? Hey, Mr. Mania, are you still there? Yes, I'm here. Can you hear me still? I'm here, hello? Maybe... Yeah, the call is still going. Yeah, hello? That's weird. Did this connect? Hold on one minute. That is weird. You can't hear me at all. I'm gonna have to do something. Do something a little drastic here. Hello? If you'll be able to edit this whole thing before the day's over. Huh. Yeah. Hold on. Isn't, isn't that quite the dream? <laughs> yeah? Of course I'll be cutting out quite a bit of footage. Sorry, it took a minute. I'm back. We have a uh, uh, swiftly uh -huh. uh, um, camp meeting USB from 2018. Uh huh. Oh, really? It just uh, swivels around. It can even shake your hand for you. Wow. Cool. I guess that's what happens when you. Uh, you watch Rick and Morty and our, and, and our board. <laughs> uh huh. So what do you think of Kayla? Uh, what do you think of? Your humor like this. So what do you think of? Well, buddy, this is the internet. Never mind. It wasn't humor. <laughs> That's funny. You're a funny guy, Andrew. Can you hear me? Hello. Coming out once again. Uh huh. Did what do you, you have for me, Mr. Swively? Yeah. Well, buddy, this is like what are you doing? Oh, no, it's just hiding in a shell. Oh, oh this is cute! What am I saying? Nice. This isn't like Rick and Morty at all. Hello? You guys there? I don't know what's going on with the mic. Is my so mic like, on? You know, yeah, it's come on. come to a point where you're so good at improvising that the lines are just either shocking or funny every time. Hello? Oh, hey, Mr. Mania. Sorry about that. My my mic was acting very, very odd. Oh. Very, very odd. Sorry about that. I just took me a little bit. Sorry so, about that, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Like, to hear all the things I was talking about while you were fixing your mic. I'm yes. Boy. When we were in here, they were messing around a little bit. Ah. So anyway. Ah. So besides like Gino and other characters, who, what games are you actually looking forward to? What am I looking forward to? Yeah. I came here to have a good time. Well, uh, oh, the countdown just started. Well, I'm watching the Nintendo Direct from Nintendo of Europe, so... Wait, the countdown started? Is that right? Yeah, on Nintendo UK, the countdown starts at around 20 minutes. You want to watch the UK one? Well, I'm watching the UK one right now. It's up to you whether you want to watch it. Okay, I want to watch the UK one. We're okay. okay. Nintendo UK. So, do they Yeah, they have their own channel. Perfect. I'm going to go there. Oh, they are. They are like starting in 20 minutes. Oh my gosh. 
All right, we're going to see it a little bit earlier than usual. All right. Actually, it's, actually it's in the uh, 40s at around uh, 4 o'clock. Yeah, 440. 440. So uh, we're not actually seeing it earlier than usual. So it basically is just going to start... At the same time worldwide. I just prefer subs over dubs. Subs over dubs? Yep, they don't see tra they don't have an interpreter over in the UK. They use subtitles. Huh. You just like hearing their voice, huh? Yep. Ah, sounds great. Sounds great. Hmm. Let's see. Ugh. So so um is there any specific games that you really want to hope they're going to be announcing? Well, I don't have any games. I don't. Well, I don't have any games that I'm hoping they, they would be announcing. It's like uh, it's like whenever you're the lead developer and the only developer of. Smash 4 Project Code, you kinda, you kinda get a loss of feel on the latest games that are coming out, you know? Hmm. Really? I guess we'll find out what games they're gonna be talking about, you know? Yeah, I, well, some of the predictions I have, which were carried over from Game Explained would be, uh, Animal Crossing for the Switch. That would probably be most likely at some point. Yeah. Because, like, let's see. Oh, yeah, a good Animal Crossing game on the Switch. Like, the ones they have on the, the DS is not, not the Amiibo Festival sync. Oh, yeah, of course. Just like the original. Just the original way how they do it. But with a different spin on it. I never really got into them. Honestly, I'm not much of a fan of them. I'm not gonna lie. I don't, I don't think they're bad games. Don't get me wrong. It's just I'm just not the biggest fan of them. I'm more of a like a Metroid, Mario. Uh, Basically, he's more of an action gamer. Oh yeah, action gamer. Yeah. Especially, yeah. I wonder. You know what I'm kind of hoping for? A new Donkey Kong Country game at some point. Yeah, I guess support wasn't enough. Yeah, I'm, I'd like to see a new Switch one, and then we get to play as, uh, let's see, some of the new, you know how they have, like, the new Funky Kong feature? Yeah. They should have that as an unlockable in the next game. That would be interesting. Hmm. Kind of, oh, well, no. Well, now that you say unlockable, I... Just thought of a scenario where your Donkey Kong is similar to an RPG. It's like he gets World Four. Hey, Funky, how's it? Oh wait, wait, don't speak English. There. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's how that's how Funky sounds. He's got that surfer twang in his grunts. Yeah. No, that sounded like that sounded like Cranky Kong. Really? Why? Well, hey. Cranky Kong with his raisin lips. <laughs> yeah. Let's hope hey, someone hey, got that reference. Sound more like this. Yeah. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Something like that. Something around that long lines. I do like Funky Kong. I really do. He's like one of my favorites. Oh, actually, did you know in Mario Kart Wii you can actually unlock him as a character? You you think I didn't know that? <laughs> oh wait, you did? Yeah, you yeah, played yeah. Nintendo games. As, you played Mario Kart Wii as well. I remember seeing it at your house. Oh goodness. Yep. My yeah, brother's Funky right now. Kong is the most popular character in Mario Kart Wii, and you think I didn't know that? Yeah. Wait, is he in the new one? In eight? Uh, no. Oh, that's stinks. He isn't. They need to add him. That would be awesome. Yeah, they really need to add him. Makes... Donkey Kong's elbows make for a great weapon. <laughs> <laughs> it 
And a surfboard, and apparently. Like, should be a, an echo fighter over you. Ken? No, ditch Ken. We're, we're going with Funky Kong Geek for you. <laughs> I'm sorry, that, that that actually caught me off guard for a minute there. Ditch Ken? Oh, do you know how many Ken fans would be so mad at you right now? Probably none. Yeah. Man, hey, I'm sorry we couldn't get, get to play Street Fighter today. Oh, well. Yeah. By the way, I want to tell you something about Street Fighter 3 if we ever actually get it to work. Well, it's uh, that game is a lot more uh, complicated. It's got, like, the same, like, idea for Street Fighter. It's got the basics in there, but there's, like, plenty of more in there that's a little bit complicated. I don't know. I've got this weird feeling right now. I, they're gonna, they're gonna announce somebody that they've been wanting. I, I, I just have a feeling. It's either Gino or Waluigi. They take out the assist trophy, because you know what? In the demos, I have not seen Waluigi. He's shown up in the video, but... I won't be surprised he's sh if he shows up. Like, I'm well, not gonna. Be. I have a, I have a hunch. Huh? What is your hunch? You know, Rathalos, the boss says his trophy. Uh huh. I won't be surprised if they have an assistant trophy also be a playable character in the same game. Oh. I guess it would be kind of weird to see Little Mac come out of an assistant trophy once again, but hey, just for old time's sake, right? I guess. But then again, they would have also Alucard as a playable character, too. No, no, no. Not, not what I meant at all. It's like... Well, if my idea goes... Ten minutes and counting. They'll have all the characters that were assistant trophies at one point, but are now playable characters. They'll also be assistant trophies. Only if the character is not in battle. Huh. That yeah. would make sense. Yeah, but that would be kind of be complicated to program, right? Nope. They did it with stages as well. If oh yeah, stage morph. On Dreamland, you won't see him as old by in the background. Huh. If you play as either Link or Toon Link on the Spirit Train stage, Alfonso will be con conducting the train instead. It is entirely possible. You've got a point, yeah. One unforeseen discussion among family later. Sorry about that, folks. <laughs> eh. I'll probably edit that part out. Too. Yeah, remember to edit that out. Anyway. I'll, re I'll remember to edit out all the non-highlight things. Yeah. By the way, did you, uh, do you know who some call me Johnny is? Oh, yeah. I remember Master Brawler recommending me to him while we were making that Mega Man 2 review. Oh, yeah, he was actually really, really good. He's really good. He's funny, too. Although, language is not the best, but hey. Eh. Aren't a lot of YouTubers like that? Eh. Yeah, I mean, after you watch them all, you know, after a while, they kind of act the same. It doesn't, it doesn't really seem like a bad quality after all that time, but mm. it's still a breath of fresh air whenever you see a YouTuber that doesn't cuss, i.e. Mm. me, you, the old ones out, etc. Yeah. Yeah. Heck, even, well, you know what I actually I'm sad about? Mm. I'm sad about this one YouTuber that just recently quit. Is oh, they... yeah. Most likely because of the uh, YouTube monetization system, right? No, actually, it was uh, Kobanomani456, and he was having a bit of a trouble with one of his exes or something like that. What? Yeah, like... I grew up, I grew up on the dude. I know, right? I'm surprised. Why, 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 are you, why would he do that? Like, he planned on doing Sonic Mania Plus, but now he's... he's done. Oh, 
I'm so surprised. He was like one of my favorite Let's Players. Yeah. Well, no, I don't want to watch him anymore. I still kind of feel bad for the guy, you know? Yeah. The guy goes through a lot. Oh, and, and I think I heard he met his dad at some point. His actual dad that he jokes about. Yeah, I know. It's weird, isn't it? Yeah. Really, really odd. Eh, it's sad. He never really got to finish that Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze speed run at all. Sadly enough. Well. Well, hold that on. Is, that is quite a surprising cause to leave YouTube for. Oh, yeah, no, it's happened before, uh... You know who Tobuscus is, right? Wait, Tobuscus had to leave as well? Oh, yeah, he left because he never... I think, I think. I can't remember, but he stopped doing it because... Like, there was a lot of lawsuits and, like, stuff that's been going around in the background. And it's not very good. It wasn't very good when it happened, so he couldn't go on YouTube anymore. I mean... Ah... Well, um, he's still up. up. He just uploaded a video two hours ago. Oh, wait, really? He's still around? Yep. He recovered from all those lawsuits. Oh, really? Good. Was, Good. That's great. He was able to get a not guilty verdict on himself, and he's doing just fine. Good. I'm glad. Let's just hope nothing else happens anyway. But, uh... You know, I'll go check out on Nick Cobramani 456 as well. Yeah, I'd probably... I would, too. It wouldn't hurt. Because I've checked on his channel. Bonner Money. Right. Cabonner Money. No. Yeah, I get... I don't know how to spell it, but hey. I don't know what's going on with him, but... Yeah, his latest video was four months ago. Yeah, I know. That's like... Wow. That's uh, four months ago. That's not normal. Usually, when he's, like, off on a break, he's probably, not like... normal, isn't it? What? Well, yeah, it's, oh wait, that guy's popular. Hmm. I was about to make a remark on how some of us don't upload a video in that amount of time or more. That's true. But then it's just, some people upload every day, so. Yeah, like, uh. Like, like, some of the popular ones, like Jacksepticeye and Markiplier, they, like, they almost upload every day. Yeah. They get really tired of it, but, like, with, uh, Jacksepticeye recently, he's work he's playing the Spy the new Spider-Man game that's, like, ooh, I'm geeking out about. It's really great. Love it. Love it. Love it. And, uh, he's been, like, doing, like, back-to-back -back videos on that, and that's it. That's the only game he's been focusing on. Well, I guess he could go Nico B's route, and it, well, I guess his schedule would be to in the morning edit see the edit the video that he just recorded, and then upload it to YouTube. After he started uploading it to YouTube, he'll start recording the next episode on a different game, and. It, and then once he's done recording, he'll chill out for the rest of the night and then rinse and repeat for here tomorrow. But that's not. But that's not what's been happening with Jack. He's been more focused on Spider-Man, and that's the only, like, since I'm subscribed to him, that's the only thing I get from him is just oh, Spider-Man. There's more Spider-Man. And hey, don't get me wrong, it's a good, it's good. Yeah, I heard it's a good game as well. Oh yeah, it's like. Dude, I'm I'm freaking out. Like some of my favorite villains show up in this in the game. You know, now that we're talking about it, I'm kind of thinking we'll get a brief mention of that Spider-Man game as a port onto the Switch. Actually, it's a PS4 exclusive. Scratch that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anyway. Uh. Yeah, it's been doing really, really well lately, and it's... Whew, it looks great. I love the game. I love the combat, although it reminds me of the Arkham series. Uh, 
but it's really good. But um, um Spider-Man did try to join the Justice League once. Oh yeah, he got rejected by Batman. Yep. Hold on one minute, I'll be right back. Okay. What? Guess why he's gone all go. Probably that first water bottle like crumb what up. That was ironic. My brother was watching a video about Jacksepticeye with the uh, Good Mythical Morning guys. You there? Huh. Hello? Andrew? I'm back. You okay? Andrew? Yeah. Alright, good. You can hear me. Just making sure. No more glitches. Oh, dang. It starts in two minutes. You better hurry. Um, well, I believe I'm settled for the rest of this. Hold on. And also, I gotta now on, uh, whenever you're recording, just call me Tech Wiper or Wiper. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. I like no, that nickname you, you gave me. Can't change. Yeah, they can. You're right. All right, less than a minute. Remains. All right, Quippy, let's do it. Quippy. Yeah. Hey, the Quip. Okay, okay. Oh, I now just thought I'm of another one. Call me Tech Wipe. <laughs> How about Quipperman? No, no, no. I I changed my mind. Only Tech Wiper, okay? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, it starts in a minute, and then we'll start the cap, and then uh, hey. Once it gets to ten, let's start counting down to ten. Okay. Yeah, my ego just got destroyed. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> the direct starts in ten, nine, eight, seven. Well. That was all the discussion Gaming Mania and I had over the Nintendo Direct, before it started anyway. If you want to see our reactions to most of the Direct, click on the link in the description and that'll take you directly to that video. As for now, have a nice day. And that is all.